What's up guys, Tony Hannity's here from LazyTalkGuys.com. Day one of TwitchCon. Unfortunately, we're not coming back tomorrow, but that doesn't matter because we had an amazing time meeting wonderful people, wonderful vendors and exhibitors. Here's what some of the people had to say. What's up, guys? I'm here at TwitchCon 2015 with Jesse. Uh, what is your Twitch uh, channel? Twitch.tv slash Little Havoc. Awesome, man. What do you stream? Uh, I'm like a variety streamer. I kind of do a little bit of like H1Z1, got like console games like Destiny, um, Halo. Bunch of, I, mean, I play a bunch of different games. Usually a lot of people like come to my channel for horror games. Okay. Because I kind of like the reaction that comes out of it. Yeah. Did yeah. you take a look at Nevermind on the Intel RealSense? Actually, I did not. It's actually kind of cool. Uh, basically, it's a first person game. You go through and it senses your heart rate. Really? With the real sense uh, camera. Oh, that's really And awesome. the faster that you, you know, you're f freaking out, the uh, quicker you can die, essentially. Is it a game? Yeah. I might have to try that out. Yeah, then. it looks pretty cool. So, like, what kind of games are you excited for in the next uh, year or so? Oh, man. There's so many. Like, right now, I'm still playing the Destiny, like, expansion they got coming out. Yeah. <laughs> And then uh, we also are probably going to be doing a little bit more like Halo that's coming out as well. But more more in tune, I'm kind of stuck to like H1Z1 as well. Because I'm really, really into that game right now. The TwitchCon being the first one of its kind. How, how have you liked it so far? Are you coming back tomorrow as well? Oh yeah, I bought this pass and I bought tomorrow's pass. But I'm actually really enjoying the, the energy that's coming from everybody. You're seeing a lot of streamers that are interacting with everybody, which I think is really awesome. And I think it's like really cool that the viewers could like interact even more with their favorite streamers as well. Great, and so one more time, if you want to let people know where to follow you. All right, twitch.tv slash Little Havoc. Stream every day, guys. Great, thanks. David, what is your impression with uh, the first ever TwitchCon here in San Francisco? There are a lot of people. It's really fun, but there are actually- I'm sorry, we're gonna have to rewind. Purple hair, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. This person's die hard. Yeah. Yeah. So, what's your what's your uh, what's your screen name? And again, back to your impressions. Um, Death Reaper Seven is what I go by on Twitch and Twitter and basically everything. Um, but yeah, for there's a lot of people. It's really fun. You get a lot of interesting stuff and a lot of free stuff, which is good. What do you stream when you when when you get back into streaming? Um, I used to stream a lot of RuneScape. And then I switched out to Dota 2 and Diablo 3 and basically a little bit of everything. Um, but real life has taken over, so I've been away for a while. But when I come back, I'm planning either RuneScape, Minecraft, or Dota, probably. Are there any upcoming games you're really excited about? I know a lot of people are excited for Fallout 4. I. I personally haven't played any of the Fallout games. Nor have I. So, Except for Fallout Shelter. That doesn't count. Which, which apparently doesn't count. So, I don't know, other than that, um, most of the games that I'm waiting for either, or was waiting for either have came out already, or they're on next gen, which I don't have. But yeah, the next Call of Duty is the main thing. Okay, all right. But overall, you've been enjoying yourself at TwitchCon. Oh, definitely. What do you want out of Twitch over the next year? Uh, basically, they've been nailing everything on the head. They've really been interactive with their partners and their non-partnered streamers. They've been trying to, you know, do whatever they can to help us out. And they know that the more they help us, the more we can help them. Do you think YouTube Gaming has any chance to overtake them? The one thing I can say is, I don't remember which streamer I was watching, but they gave a quote that I absolutely loved. Like, it would be great to have competition from YouTube Gaming, but knowing YouTube Gaming, there isn't going to be competition. So it would be nice to have a competitor, you know, somebody to push us forward, but sure. I don't think they're going to be the one to do it. I don't and think it's what it, is, is that because of the community, or is there something um, else because of limitations of licensing and things like that. It's partially because of the community, because everybody that watches YouTube stuff is used to watching the stuff that's pre-recorded and they just want to skip to the good stuff and they don't want to wait. And then the other part of that is that so many people in this type of community that want to watch live stuff are already watching Twitch and there's really nothing that YouTube gaming is offering to make them switch. It's just like, oh, well, you know, it's also Twitch, so if you want to completely ditch everything you did and come over and start new, for no extra bonus, then you can. So, 
Well, that's a great insight. Well, thank you so much for your time, and why don't you let people know one more time how they can find you? Um, you can find me on Twitch or Twitter at Death's Reaper 7. I believe my YouTube is 7 Death's Reaper. Um, other than that, just, you know, look around. Great. Thanks very much. What's up, guys? Tony Hannity's here. I'm here with Lindsay here at TwitchCon 2015 with all of her friends. Uh, Lindsay, is this this is your first TwitchCon? I'm uh, what's the first ever, right? First convention. First convention. Wow. What, uh, what 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 do you think of TwitchCon today? It's actually, really awesome. Meeting everybody and just I don't know, really cool energy. And so, what kind of games do you play on Twitch? A lot of CS:GO, H1Z1, Binding of Isaac. Minecraft. <laughs> uh, have you taken part of any of the panels that they had today? Do you, are you walking away with any knowledge that you couldn't have just YouTubed or Googled before? Uh, I went to the branding panel. That was helpful. They talk about, you know, different people who have done brands on Twitch and stuff. So, I mean, I haven't, I haven't got to go to a lot of panels yet. It's a lot of uh, just meeting people. Okay. I mean, Twitch is really about the community, right? So, I mean, that's what's really going to build that up. Do you think YouTube gaming is going to have that issue? Like, they're going to get a community similar to this, or they just have no uh, chance in hell, so to speak? They they have a little chance. I don't know. From what I've heard, I, I don't know. Twitch, it's nice what you said. Twitch is about the community. It's what they said at the keynote. It's just like, you, you feel like it's a family. And it just it's very welcoming. Very It's very community-oriented. And with YouTube, I've heard, like, they don't... I guess some people don't feel that way about it. It's very distant with the platform kind of thing. So you're like on your own. Is there anything out of Twitch you'd like to see changed or get better over the next few years or so? <sighs> Partner me. No. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know. They're doing an awesome job. I think I like how they add, they listen to people and they add a few. They add things, see how it goes, and I, I can't think of anything. Great. That's their job. So, if people want to follow you on Twitch or Twitter or however, how can they do that? Uh, click the follow button on my channel, twitch.tv slash beams. All right, great. Well, <laughs> thank you so much. No, it's fine. You were great. Thank you so much, and we'll talk to you guys in a bit. What's up, guys? I'm Tony Hannity with LazyTechGuys.com, and we're outside the Mirror to Food booth. But more importantly, we're here with actual Twitch gamers. And guys, why don't you introduce yourselves? Oh. Good <laughs> My name is Darian. I don't really stream, but I'm just with these two. Oh, that's awesome. Hi, my name is Michael. On Twitch, I'm known as Force of Hell, 775. I'm Brandon, otherwise known as Caffeine Writer on Twitch. So what do you guys stream on Twitch? Pretty much you name it, I stream it. I pretty much like to stream what the people want to watch most of the time. But, I don't know, pretty much anything we can find. It's nice to just keep a nice variety, keep people coming, and the people that come really like to stay in the community. So. Where, are you, where are you guys from? I'm from Nevada. And I'm from Los Angeles. And like the, the Twitch community obviously is huge, but uh, with TwitchCon, how, how has this experience been for you so far? Oh, it's been amazing. Like when I started Twitch, I, like, I live in a small town and I haven't really left that area that much. And I wasn't even planning on coming here, but my viewers were like, you're getting to TwitchCon, here's money, you're going. I'm wow. like, all right, if you guys... And then I just actually met one of my viewers over there that... Yeah, like right there, I just met one of my viewers over there. I'm like, oh wow, this is amazing actually. Yeah, like, I actually started a as a viewer of his stream as well. So. Well, that's very cool. So, w with YouTube gaming kind of being on the rise now, how do you guys uh, feel about, you know, I guess Google going up against Amazon slash Twitch? They don't have a chance. Yeah, Twitch I'll just has too good of a community. YouTube won't be able too to Too big of a it. following already. I don't think it's really going to shake the Twitch community at all. Well, that's a great, great outlook. Well, thank you very much, guys. It was a pleasure to meet you. And where can our viewers find you guys? Twitter, Twitch, uh, Caffeine Writer on both. And then I'm Forcevel775 on Twitch, and then just Forcevel on Twitter and YouTube. And of course, you can find us here at TwitchCon! Yeah, there you go. Thanks a lot, guys.